guten Tag. Ich bin ein von 100 von Riesen, du hätten Bayern München! Which is proper German for 100 reasons to hate Bayern Munich. Let's start with your players. Thiago, we didn't even want you, mate. Ribery, you look like a 15th century knight. Robin, you're a diving piece of sh Except against Arsenal when they definitely fouled you. Muller. You're not a yoga mate! I tell you this about Muller, I bet he takes the corners, doesn't he? I bet you, bet you like um, rice pudding. Why have you got Shakira playing in defence? She's a pop star! No wonder you've got a defender called Dante, because your club is the fourth circle of hell. And that was a medieval literature reference for you YouTubers out there. Ich habe ein Blumentopf! Schweinsteiger in German officially means pig's penis. Look at her! Tony Cruz's tweets are rubbish! Oliver Kahn looks like a slightly cheesed off honey monster. Effenberg? There's only one Effenberg in football! and that's Henenberg. Franz Beckenbauer was overrated. Oktoberfest? Oktoberfest? It's in September! Why do all your women dress as milkmaids? They can't all be milkmaids! Oh, and by the way, your stadium sausages are the worst. Thank you, thank you. Take that, haters! Your beer is flat! Your ball, boys, are inefficient. Your badge looks like it was designed by a five-year-old on an etch sketch Scribble, scribble, scribble! I'm designing a badge today! Two words for you. Barcelona, 1999. Oh, the Beatles! We were so close! Shut up! Ich wohne in ein Einfamilienhaus! You won the European Cup three times in a row. Das ist just unfair, yeah? Celebrity fans, who have you got? Boris Becker and that Pope who couldn't hack it. You're Pope for life, mate, not just for Christmas. Dear Ian, I like your videos, but I think you overstepped the mark with your comments about the Pope. Use the typewriter. You're in the dark ages, mate! You've got too much money. Zeit den Bayern die Lederhosen aus! Oh, a bit cheeky. Oh yeah, you love beer, don't you? Oh, you love a good beer. I'll tell you who doesn't love a good beer. Frank Ribery. So why'd you pour it all over his head? Poor chap. No wonder he had to console himself by going down to the local broth. Allegedly. Allegedly. All right. You're unbeaten in the league this season. Who does that? Butter brot? It's Sasani. Oh, Pep Guardiola, don't get me wrong. He's definitely a genius. He goes to the treble winners, takes some of the best players from his competitors, and after all that, he's still winning. Oh, well done. What a mug. Oh, you think it's pretty easy, don't you? You think you're straight through with the semi-finals? You got your towels out on your semi-final deck chairs already? Well, guess again, Bayern. Guess again. You're about to get murked. Robin, oh, you're in good form, mate, but you are going to come across one of the tightest defences in Europe, in the world. You're going to get murked. You're going to get seriously murked by one of the best left-backs in the game, Alex Butner. He's going to be throwing in tackles. He's going to be doing headers, crosses, passes. He's going to be heading some of his tackles. He doesn't care. We're going to win it and the whole crowd will be singing Butner's name. Hold on away, fans. Butner, Butner. He's going to get Robin's face tattooed right here. Even if he has to erase some of his tattoos that are already there, he's going to... No, he's not going to get Ribery tattooed on him because he's got no respect for this fool at all. We're going to go through to the semi-finals where we'll meet Madrid, win them, Final, I don't care who we play it, we're going to win the Champions League. It's going to happen, and it's going to happen because of one man, Alex Butner. Fuck, fuck, I think that's going to happen. You've got Pellegrini. He sounds like a brand of Italian sparkling water, which is not a good thing. He looks like, and I, I don't say this often, but he looks like balls. 